Hello dear friends, I'm Marina and this is your daily astrology horoscope for the 9th of February. Today we have one challenging aspect between the Sun and Saturn. There is a semi-square between these two planets, which can possibly bring some challenges for us. First of all, Saturn is very strong. Saturn is in Capricorn, it will stay there for a very long time. And now that it squares the Sun, it means that we may need to overcome some challenges. There might be some kind of obstacles and generally things may not be moving as fast as we would like to. So it's really important to learn to be patient, especially today. Don't rush things, don't hurry too much. And also respect the authority figures. It might be tough with Saturn squaring the Sun or semi-squaring the Sun. It might be difficult for us. We may want to do things in our own way, especially when the Sun is in Aquarius. You know that Aquarius is the sign of independence, doing things in our own way. And basically Aquarius and Uranus people, they are uh, revolutionists. They want to do everything in a different way and they want to break the rules very often. So now that we have a challenging aspect between a planet in Aquarius and Saturn in Capricorn, it might be tough to do things in our own way. We may need to neglect this desire and accept the rules. So generally, I would say that today is not the best time to negotiate, especially with authority figures or some government issues and, you know, things related to, to communicating with big structures and your organizations. They might be more difficult today. So if possible, you can postpone these activities. The good news is that the transit moon will be in Sagittarius. And Sagittarius is the sign which can bring optimism to Capricorn and Saturn energy. So even if the situation is a little bit more difficult, Sagittarius moon may help us to feel uh, more positive, to see the good side in everything and to be optimistic about tomorrow. So that's the most important for today. Thank you so much for joining me and I'll see you tomorrow.